Hey guys, welcome to Andy's Fan Cells. This is another update video on how my fan cell dust are getting on. Um, basically, uh, for youngest baby, what I've transferred in here um, is over there, just behind that fan tail, having a drink. Um, I think it's a male. Um, but I can't be sure, so, uh, but, um, I've let them out, uh, this week, a uh, couple of days, um, and basically if I've been flying around, um, it was raining one day, and, um, I'm not sure uh, about anybody else who has, uh, fan tills, uh, but my fan tills, when they get really wet, because uh, I let them out when it was raining one day and uh, if they can't fly uh, when they get really really stuck and wet um, I'm not, some of them can fly some of them can't um, with that um, half no, if that's a quarter uh, fell uh, puts in um, his father is half fan till half fell um, puts in but uh, that's a, a male as you can tell by the dance um, I just put the red ring on it sorry the red ring on it so I know that it's male what I tend to do um, with my, uh, with my uh, doves Fancil doves, and I put uh, a red ring for the males and the um, yellow ring for females, so I know which is which. Um, I tend to do this uh, when they hit adulthood because I know then which is a male, which is a female. Um, because when if they're in the pot, I can't tell if it's male or female. I can only tell you know, like uh, in the adulthood. So um, that's why I have to wait a few weeks uh, when I transfer them into here, uh, just to um, test their behaviour to see if they're a male or female, and it works. Um, what I feed my fantail doves on, it's called um, breed and wean. Um, basically, it's a I think it's a kilo a bag, um, and it lasts for about two weeks. Uh, and it, and I feed them, and for breed and wean um, seed. You can get for racing pitsons any sort of pitson type, um, and I feed them that because and it 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 does work for them, um, and I also feed them bread as well because um, they when I put bread down they eat a whole lot um, and it does usually help. Um, just for the young as well uh, in back uh, because uh, then I know that if I get, when I give them bread and seed uh, that the babies are in back are getting food and they're growing up nice and yeah um, I give them bread every other day and I give them seed like every day so uh, and if you're watching this video in the UK, uh, for breed and wean, it's a blue bag. Uh, I haven't got a bag with me, cause, um, but um, yeah, it's a big blue bag, and it's the best for uh, breeding fantails. So uh, yeah. A little advice for you guys. Um, I'll show you guys what's going on in the back.
Oh. Well, yesterday I uh, came in and the eggs has hatched um, in this nest. Um, the female is a bit aggressive, as you can tell. But we've got two babies there. We also got for two babies in here, um, which is nice and um, growing nice and healthy. Um, I think we've got another week to go until uh, I transfer, well, till I transfer them in the AV. and healthy, it's getting all its rivets. Just sitting there quietly. This baby here is um, again getting its rivets, um, going nice and healthy. Um, these two babies here has um, was hats on the same day, but they're from different nests. So, uh, yeah. But usually, every time, every morning when I come in, it tries to feed on my fingers, but it must, <laughs> it's not doing it for you guys. So, but it's not. Looks like it's going to have a nice uh, big tail on it. This baby here uh, is again growing nice and healthy. Hopefully, it'll uh, reach adulthood, so we'll see. And in here, we've got the quarter fowl, um, pitson, and dove uh, in here. Um, as you can tell, um, the quarter fell pitson has got a fan tail on it, um, but it's uh, the little sister has got a bit of a curved tail. So, um, what, what I find odd is basically uh, it's got no right through it at all. It's, it's a really odd colour. Um, it's not your normal um, ring, no sorry, blue bar, uh, check. Um, it hasn't got any patterns on it like it's a um, grandma. But um, yeah, it's just a really odd colour. I've never seen that colour before. It's like it's all it's all brownie grey. Um, but hopefully, when uh, when it gets nice and big, um, you can see what colour it is uh, when I transfer them in the AV. So yeah. And yeah, uh, we've reached the end of the video folks. Thank you for subscribing to my new subscribers. Um, please rate, comment uh, on my videos. Um, uh, for, announce for announcement, what I've got to make now is that um, I'm going away on holiday and my family is looking after my birds. So 
if we won't be able to do them next Saturday, uh, or in the next two, three weeks. Um, so, uh, but when I get back off holiday, I'll be uh, back to my filming every week. But there's going to be uh, one last video before I go on holiday, so look out for that. Uh, and yeah, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe on my channel, and I will see you guys soon.